I think it's apparent that it's actually a it's not the priority. I mean, you look in the budget and the university uh, the UNC system is required to make another what they call a flexibility cut. So it's like you have to find X million dollars to in, in additional cuts. And the last that I, the last figure I have is I think that uh, over the last seven or eight years, the combined uh, flexibility cut, which is basically them saying find operating cuts in your operating budget is well over $600 million away from other cuts in the budget. This is just just fine extra meat, uh, what they call meat on the bones, but there's no meat, more meat on the bones. You're basically cutting into the bone right now. And that has implication because we're saying that we want to make sure kids graduate from uh, college on time, that they are workforce ready, have the skills that need that, that's needed to attract jobs and boost the economy here. But when you look at the budget, it raises serious questions of are we really ensuring that our public university system, which is a national model for, you know, uh, a system that extends uh, access to education to a a large number of people in the state, uh, it raises a question about the quality of that, uh, this this asset in the state going forward. Um, What do you say? uh, Obviously, you've heard this argument a lot. Senator Berger and others say the reason that they always put tax cuts first is that it grows the economy and helps everybody. And that's what's that's why North Carolina has had the Carolina comeback. Right. And so I, I guess uh, a number of other states, uh, other states can add uh, come back into the, on their on the front end of their their state's name because the reality is in North Carolina's recovery is uh, basically mimicking the national economy. So we had uh, we have uh, five five hundred and eighty million dollar revenue over collections, uh, but Georgia is expecting the same thing, and other states are seeing their uh, economy, their respective eco- state economies improving. And so to attribute the tax cuts to Something that's naturally happening uh, across the nation is uh, one is incorrect, and two, it leads to choices as we're seeing with the Senate budget is that it's being used to promote more tax cuts that reduces the revenue that will be available to ensure that uh, prosperity in the state is broadly shared rather than flowing to essentially the the the, the wealthiest here in the state. 